Plants are unique living organisms that convert free carbon dioxide, a waste material from the atmosphere into an energy source for life, called starch, a storable form of glucose. This process is carried out in the absence of light in the process of photosynthesis hence called dark reaction of photosynthesis the source of energy is light which produces NADPH and ATP. Carbon fixation a long chain of six carbon compounds is formed by adding carbon dioxide. It's the basic source of energy for life. Involving many reactions, these reactions are collectively been named the Calvin cycle, the photosynthetic carbon reduction cycle, or the C3 photosynthetic pathway, because the first product is 3PGA, which contains three carbon atoms. Site of reaction This reaction takes place in the stroma of the chloroplast in the green mesophyll cells of the plants. Steps in dark reaction. It is initiated by 5-carbon compound ribulose 5-phosphate which forms two molecules of 3-phosphoglyceraldehyde. The dark reaction is divided into three main parts, carboxylation, reduction, and regeneration. Carboxylation involves the addition of carbon dioxide and water to ribulose 5-phosphate forming two molecules of 3-PGA. Reduction is of the carboxyl group in 3-PGA to an aldehyde group in 3-phosphoglyceraldehyde. Reduction does not occur directly but the carboxyl group of 3-PGA is first converted to an acid anhydride type of ester as 1,3-bisphosphoglyceric acid. By the addition of the terminal phosphate group from ATP. This ATP arises from photosynthetic phosphorylation, and the ADP released when 1,3-bis-PGA is formed is quickly converted back to ATP by additional photosynthetic phosphorylation reactions. The reducing agent is NADPH, which donates two electrons to the top carbon atom in the anhydride ester group. Simultaneously, Phosphate is released from that group to be used again to convert ADP to ATP. Thus, for each carbon dioxide, which is fixed, to NADP and two ATP are required here. A third ATP is used in the regeneration phase, making the total requirement of three ATP and two NADP for each molecule of carbon dioxide fixed and reduced. Regeneration of ruby P needed to react with additional carbon dioxide. This complex phase involves phosphorylated sugars with 4, 5, 6 and 7 carbons. In the final reaction of the Calvin cycle, the third ATP that is required for each molecule of carbon dioxide is fixed to convert ribulose 5-phosphate to ribulose 1,5-biphosphate. The cycle then begins again. Some 3-p-goldehyde molecules are used in chloroplasts to form starch, a major photosynthetic product in most species. When photosynthesis occurs rapidly, Others are transported, and some are converted to the hydroxyacetone phosphate, a similar 3-carbon triose phosphate that can be transferred out of chloroplasts by the same antiport system. This system helps keep the total amount of phosphate constant in the chloroplast but leads to the net appearance of triose phosphates in the cytosol, used in the cytosol to form sucrose, Selvol polysaccharides, and hundreds of other compounds of which the plant is made. Their transport is especially important because the numerous other sugar phosphates of the Calvin cycle are largely held within the chloroplast. Mm -hmm.